It was confirmed today that she routinely sent classified emails on an insecure private server that could be easily hacked by hostile foreign agents. And we learned that people she emailed were hacked and probably, I think maybe definitely, were hacked by these hostile actors. And these are bad but very, very smart people. A hell of a lot smarter than what we have in Washington. That I can tell you. Our enemies may have a blackmail file on Crooked Hillary, and this alone means that she should not be allowed to serve as President of the United States. We now know, just wrote this out, we now know that she lied to the country when she said she did not send classified information on her server. She lied. She sent vast amounts of classified information, including information classified as top secret. Top secret, okay? And this is where they said that she was extremely careless and, frankly, I say, grossly incompetent. She will be such a lousy president, folks. So sad. Okay. The lives of the American people were put at risk by Hillary Clinton so that she could carry on her corrupt financial dealings, probably. That's probably why she didn't want people to see what the hell she was doing. She went to extraordinary lengths to carry out an Enron cell purge of her emails. 33,000 emails are missing, and they say, oh, she's fine, she's fine. 33,000. And I've always been told you can't really get rid of an email. Have you ever heard this? That if we have the real super geniuses that know this stuff, they say you can't get rid of emails. But we didn't use them because they didn't want to use them. They didn't want to use them. So, like a criminal with a guilty conscience, Clinton had her lawyers delete, destroy, and wipe away forever. Except, I still say, there are geniuses that can find them. 30,000, think of this, 30,000 emails. This again disqualifies her from service. And just think of it. I mean, how can you have this? We know now that these deletions included emails that were work-related. One more big, fat, beautiful lie by Crooked Hillary. Any government employee who engaged in this kind of behavior would be barred from handling classified information. Again, that alone disqualifies her. And again, Bernie Sanders talked about bad, bad judgment, but he's not happy tonight, folks, because now it looks like it's over for Bernie. But you know what? I have a feeling they're going to have a lot of people marching on Philadelphia. Let's see what happens, okay? Let's see. I don't know about you, but I always felt that Hillary Clinton would escape criminal charges for her dangerous and illegal behavior because I always knew, and I always see, and it's so sad that our system is, in fact, rigged. It's totally rigged, okay? It's corrupt, it's rigged, it's disgraceful. You have a statement made today at 11 o'clock, then you have a big speech by the President flying in on Air Force One with Hillary Clinton a few hours later, even though we have more people here than they do, but we won't say that. So the AG met with the president, had to, before the announcement. I mean, how about that? Met with President Bill Clinton. How about that deal, right? He's waiting around. He's waiting at the airport. Oh, oh, look, the AG's come. Oh, let me go say hello. 39 minutes. I'm going to talk about the grandkids. He's got two. I hear they're beautiful. I hear they're beautiful. He's got two. Now, I have eight grandchildren. And I will tell you, I can talk about them. And after I say 
Isn't he beautiful? Isn't he beautiful? Oh, I love this guy. I love the kid. I love him. But after about a minute, I can't go much longer. <laughs> I want to get the business, right? For you, I want to get the business. But he didn't talk about it. He talked about golf, okay? So he talked about the grandkids, and I would say that would take anywhere from 30 seconds to a minute. Seriously. Uh, am I right? I mean, you know, how long can you talk? <laughs> Mr. Attorney General, I have the most beautiful grandchildren you've ever seen. Let me show you a picture. Isn't that great? Let me show you another picture. What do you think? I think they're beautiful. starting to run out of words. That's 30 seconds. Now he's going to talk about golf. I know more about golf than he does. You can't talk about golf that way. It's just... Hey, Jack Nicklaus is the greatest. The greatest. He is. Tiger. When's Tiger coming back? Adam Scott's wonderful. He won a Doral. We love Adam Scott. Phil Mickelson, we love that. What are you going to talk? You can't talk much longer. <laughs> Couple of minutes. Okay? I don't think they went over the swing and the technique or anything. <laughs> Let's talk about Hillary! Let's talk! 